health and wellness checking for this past week so monday 13 november 2023 to today sunday 19 november 2023 it was a well-balanced week socially and mentally and i made all of my workouts so that's the introduction and week summary up first is social i fed the critter critters all of their meals this week i lived with my parents they're both retired so i had those interactions and then I also had interactions while walking and running. And I saw yesterday, Saturday, Jordan Redford was running as well. He was a little bit more uh, daredevil than I was. He was wearing shorts. And um, I wear shorts, but then I wear like wool socks or knee-high socks. So like I have less skin exposed. And he, he was wearing shorts and I was like, whoa, <laughs> daredevil. Um, and I told my parents about it when I got back. My dad was impressed that he was out there running. Um, and it was, I think it was on Timber Lane in Woodway. <laughs> Timber Lane is a hopping place <laughs> in Woodway. Um, and Jordan Redford was someone who used to swim on Innis Arden as well. And I swam on Innis Arden. I think we had some overlap when we both swam on the team. But then he became like a uh, lifeguard. I think he did the whole like cleaner lifeguard, senior lifeguard, and then he was pool manager. So he was actually my supervisor. And he was one of the people, uh, when I first got hired on at Innis Arden Swim Club, he was one of the people who interviewed me when, back when I was 14 years old, approximately 14 years old. I started working that summer. I was 14 years old. Um, so yeah, so it was fun seeing him. And so I was brought up and my dad was impressed. My mom was like, you know, first thing, or, you know, she was like, she said something and then was like, um, is he married? He got married, right? And then, you know, next topic of conversation. And then she made a little quip, you know, because Chad is taking his sweet time and, uh, you know, coming in my soulmate and or soulmates and coming and getting me and moving me home and getting married and stuff. She's like, well, some children grow up and get married, <clears throat> you know, to me, like, where are your men? Kind of thing. So, yeah. So there was that. And then, okay. Other outings with social interactions included 7-Eleven, a convenience store on Monday, Fred Meyer, a department store on Monday, Winco Foods, a supermarket on Tuesday, Azelle's Famous Chicken, Fried Chicken Restaurant on Wednesday, uh, Richmond Beach Community Park, a public park on Thursday, Richmond Beach Library, a public library on Thursday, Burger King, a burger restaurant on Thursday, The Home Depot, a home supply store on Friday. Bartell Drugs, a pharmacy and miscellaneous supplies store. I don't really know. I think I've tried classifying it before, so I'm going with this this time. And that was Friday. Uh, Quality Food Centers, QFC, a grocery store on Friday. And then Bothell Feed Center, a feed and pet supply store on Friday. And then Quality Food Centers, QFC, a grocery store on Friday. They were different QFCs. Okay. Mental. Uh, consistent output week and good mental stability. Yes. Okay, um, it was a, I spaced it out. I did like consistent output this week, which was like, instead of doing a big adventure day, I tried to do like one adventure a day or like a couple places, but close together. The The thing and that's nice about an adventure day is um, instead of driving a certain distance five times, I drive it once. So there's like uh, that kind of thing. So yeah. But I did a good on that. It didn't become overwhelming at any point. So that was pretty cool. And then we have fight, fighting, <laughs> not fighting, <laughs> writing, <laughs> which, you know, some people can be like, the pen is mightier than the sword. Um, but this was just writing. Writing in photography on Yelp. I reached uh, 24 written and published reviews for November 2023. I reached 390 written and published reviews for the 2023 year thus far which increased my all-time personal best for a number of reviews in any one calendar year. I reached how many check-ins for the 2023 year for my tracking? New all-time personal best for me in any one calendar year, so it increased from last month. Maybe I'll work on finding out what that number is. Okay, so that was Yelp. It was, let's see here it's been a big year on yelp so i would classify going back to like i brought up earlier in the year about like being a prolific making the 50 most prolific in north america list back in 2020 um and that that was a lot of work and stuff 
uh, and um, uh, the, I would consider this year an attempt. So I'm approaching it similarly in terms of getting a lot of check-ins, getting a number of first to reviews, which I kind of did earlier in the year, um, but then also just pushing myself to see what I can do in terms of total number of reviews. And that year, I think at, at the time it was like 300 reviews, but then now only 298 of those reviews still exist kind of thing. Um, so 390 is I'm almost 100 over what I did um, 2020. Um, and I reached the number is 513 check-ins for the 2023 year per my tracking, which is a new all-time personal best for me for any one calendar year. All right. Writing for Lucky Wallaby Courier. Did eating slash food, including restaurants. Uh, yeah. I did, so wildlife, yes. Uh, road running route coverage. Previously used for running, currently used for walking slash running. So yes, that was the driving stuff. That was, yeah. Fun, um, hands off, trying to get my camera set up kind of thing in my car. Statement on human rights violations by user Corsellus on Wikipedia uh, and by Wikipedia more generally. Yeah, I actually finished that. So I started it on 16 June, 2023. And then I think it was six no, five months to the day, 16 November, 2023. Um, so started on 16 June, 2023. So six months uh, or five months, sorry, with like to the calendar day, um, kind of finished it, printed it out. I even have a hard copy of it and I put it in the same folder. So same binder as the letter from the guy who tried to kick me out of UC Berkeley. Now, interestingly with that case, I had, I was still studying at the university and had a different advisor in less than five months after I was handed that letter. Um, so you, so user Corsellus and Wikipedia and or Wikipedia, no, and Wikipedia because they're editing and blocking through Wikipedia is actually worse than the University of California numerically, statistically, because it, uh, they've, Blocked me longer, so to speak. So I actually have a new worst uh, organization in my life. It's no longer the University of California, Berkeley. Now it's the Wikimedia Foundation. Yeah. So published about that, printed it out, and it's in storage. Okay. Uh, when I, I, and then I also covered when I moved to California in 2015, which I didn't take a bunch of pictures. So it was different. It, it was sad because it was, uh, yeah, it left the dogs again and stuff like that. Okay. All right, up next, YouTube, themed day of the week videos continued. I had at least one sweet and or savory eats video each day, filmed and published the same day. I did hypothetical wedding planning, so that's the Chad, the clothes stuff. Um, some of it, you know, if I get married to him and move in with him and or others and other of my soulmate and or soulmates. Uh, some of it might carry forward to other of my weddings then as well. Um, and some of the videos I've put out, such as terminology videos, might apply to different uh, weddings as well. So thinking through, like, a wedding playlist, but then what also have I talked about? But then also thinking about which of these um, might carry to other weddings as well. So not just one wedding playlist, but there could be a bunch, you know, kind of thing, depending on how that goes. And that kind of stuff. And what channels, how, how do I make those playlists and stuff? So there, there was like video wedding playing, but then there's also like the off channel, but on computer wedding playing. And then there's also the thought processes. All right. I also did a vlog slideshow with text transitions and overlays, uh, that kind of style. Uh, for when I moved to Berkeley, California in 2015, I am working on more moving vlogs of the same style. So I have, if, looking through my pictures and what I have and that I could put up is a moving like to the sorority and then on campus at the University of Washington. I don't necessarily have a lot of pictures from each of those. So I might group, group those together into like a 2010, 2011, a couple places I moved kind of vlog. There's moving to South Africa, which I don't I have pictures in my room, but I didn't like do all of my room layouts and stuff. So maybe like a picture or two of me while I was in South Africa. Um, yeah. And then, so the two, uh, then moving to Hawaii the first time I moved around a bunch, right? <laughs> when in attending the University of Washington and then the University of Hawaii at Manoa to do like a kind of the first move. Uh, there's a uh, moving to Albany from Berkeley. Um, those are both in California in 2016. And there's moving back here 
to Washington State in 2019. That one I have almost 300 pictures and videos from. So that one is like the big one, so to speak, is like I was looking through that and I took like, I think it was 280 some pictures and videos and I was like, I don't even know where to begin. Because like that one is like a true, like I have pictures from when we went and looked at U-Haul sizes to find out which U-Haul size I needed. Like, so that one was almost painstakingly um, compared to the other ones. All right, that was the first one. Albany was pretty good too. But like, that was the first one that I was like, just take a bunch of pictures. But then I didn't necessarily take a bunch of videos and I didn't really take pictures with me in it. So like, I'm trying to do it right this time for like, if slash when I move in with my soulmates, you know, <laughs> like I'm trying, okay. Anyway, so I'm, I'm thinking on that. That isn't, uh, I'm wor working on more moving vlogs of the same style, but like, that doesn't mean it's going to be all out today. Right? It's a, that kind of thing. Okay. Up next, finances. I made $30 cleaning my parents' part of the house. Yes, I clean on Thursdays. So next Thursday, or this coming Thursday, is Thanksgiving, So which is when I was supposed to clean, but we're going to go be celebrating Thanksgiving in uh, Oak Harbor. <laughs> so we're gone for the day. So I was like, all right, I'm going to clean it early and then clean it after, because I clean every other week. So we're just switching the week um, and, and changing the schedule that way. Uh, I paid off my credit card statement, boo -boo. and then my current sweet and or savory eats videos fund, including gas expenses, is at one hundred and eighty-eight dollars and seventy-six cents. I spent fifty-three dollars fifty-eight cent uh, cents since the fund was at two hundred and forty-two dollars thirty-four cents on Sunday, twelve November two thousand twenty-three, last Sunday. I did eleven videos, which included twenty-three products and zero gas feelings. Yeah, I'm gonna be winding down or changing how I do with the sweet and or savory ease videos, getting my last wedding tasting stuff through, you know, um, it, it's kind of, yes, that, I guess get that kind of the tastings for wedding stuff kind of got peaked this last past April, 2023. So there's, I've got some places, but trying to like kind of to bring that, get it done, tone it down. Um, cause I, I only put 500 of my 900 for my retirement account towards that stuff kind of thing. Though I've been getting my running stuff from uh, uh, f uh, with some Amazon gift cards and I've gotten some Christmas presents. So we'll see. Well, I've been doing good. I might be able to put like another 200 from the retirement fund into the fund. But first, I'm going to focus on finishing the wedding tasting stuff. Okay. All right. Up next. Um, or wedding tasting can be it for my Chad and I wedding or another wedding like me in... So both fly. Although that'd be fun to get married in Hungary, mm, in a stadium or something. And then do we do food over there? Be very cool. We, yeah. Okay. Anyway, search engine start stuff. Search engine search. New turn of events. All references listed on my Wikipedia user page that I am currently banned from editing no longer show up when I search myself. That is Wikipedia. Uh, is making a negative impact to my searchability and job prospects. Yes. Um, I don't really know how to process that right now. There's probably very strong legal actions I could take about against them and win on. Uh, however, I have no means to pursue that uh, currently. I'm kind of thinking, and is the legal system really the right avenue to pursue on dealing with something like that? Like, the legal system's all about making money, not necessarily making things right. That kind of thing. At least in the United States of America. Okay. Yeah. Uh, all right, wildlife sighting, new for me, golden crowned kinglet. It had an orange crown color. It was very cool. It was approximately 3.50 p.m. on Monday, 19 November 2023, so the afternoon. All right. Physical. Did good on maintenance, food intake slash weight regulation. I started uh, menstruating two days earlier. Made my workouts five out of five days for running. Made my workouts six out of six days for rowing. Made my workouts six out of six days for strength training. Made my workouts two days for cleaning house slash yard work. Uh, stationary bicycle made my workout one day. Yes. And I've got some random talking stuff, but maybe I'll do a random talking stuff. Take this tiny little post-it. This is stuff I thought of today. And like... Um, oh, okay, one. Very timely. I, I don't do fragrances for, like, modeling, if I go into modeling, but I do like the scent of my men, like my Sobosla, after a full soccer match, football match, soccer game, football game. Uh, natural without any deodorant or stuff. That's the fragrance I love. My men without uh, anything additive. They're natural. Yeah, happy week of wellness. I'm Tanis Corley Leonardi, and this is my YouTube channel, Tanis Leonardi.